let's get back to uh, this one so let's maybe give uh, give it a task here right okay so let us uh, try um, uh, giving agent gpt a task and see how it executes uh, so i've uh, done this before but let's say that uh, we are asking it to create a clone chrome plugin which is a uh, difficult task right so it's not uh, straightforward let's see how it actually uh, creates tasks and try to uh, get that done for us create a chrome pl uh, plugin to turn text to voice on a web page so any page you go right it'll actually turn the text into voice so that's a simple task which we are giving it so now what it does is it kind of analyzes our prompt and it tries to create a sequence of steps which it has to do to get to that uh, task which we uh, uh, gave it and now right so the first step which it created for itself is research and gather information on existing text to speech apis and libraries that's impressive right so uh, the second one is develop a script to integrate the chosen api or library with chrome browser then design and implement a user friendly interface for the plugin right so you trying to do the same with uh, chat gpt right you basically have to uh, come up with all of these tests on how to uh, get that done and all of that right now auto gpt is doing all of this for you and now you can see it basically completing one one task by another one so it says completing right uh, test task executed the user friendly interface for chrome plugin turn to text to voice web page has been designed and implemented and then it creates another set of tasks right task uh, test the functionality of the chrome plugin now it's kind of testing the functionality of the chrome plugin so it kind of gives itself tasks till it achieves the final step which it, we are asking it to do it so it's pretty amazing so what are your thoughts uh, thoughts on this oh love that so it's basically generating a code and giving it to us or will it deploy the code and put it in github and do all those things as well for us so maybe I mean, down yeah, the line this this is a very simple version of it right funny so when you actually do it uh, have auto gpt on your pc on a local machine so it outputs the code as text and all of that stuff and you know you could also have third parties integrated where it goes to a browser and maybe uh, submits the chrome plugin for you and all of that stuff but you have to give it credentials and all of that so i'd say it's it's still still at a very initial stages right which the use cases are very little but imagine uh, as this grows and it's able to do perfect tasks for you like what can the potential of this could be so yeah. can you click on that export Especially button doing the project plan yeah can you click on that export button let's see what what it will export so uh, it will actually exp export all of the prompts and all of the steps which is trying to do okay uh, no if it actually tells that hey these are the tasks and under each task this is the thing that i did that is amazing because yeah, i think that's what we can we can is. utilize to do several things yeah it's yeah. basically creating a project plan for <laughs> yep yep 